Good evening, everyone. I'm John Garlock. New at 6 tonight, the Adair County Commission and the Second Judicial Circuit Court have made some headway in the way funds will be allocated in the future. The county received revenues that should have been directed to the Juvenile Justice Center as outlined in a December 4, 2014 settlement agreement. Today, the commissioners amended the 2015 budget to reflect that money in the form of an increase in revenue for the Juvenile Justice Fund in the amount of just over $39,000. That money will also be included in the expense account as a non-secure reimbursement pass-through fund. There are funds that there are reimbursement and payments for 2015. Um, we thought they would be going directly to the Second Circuit, which is what they were supposed to be doing. Uh, the state had a delay on getting all that processed, so the first deposit they made for the year came into the county instead of going directly to the Second Circuit. And once we were aware that they were here, we are doing the amendment in order to transfer them on. In the future, revenues for the Juvenile Justice Center in Kirksville that are non-secure will be directed to the center's Director of Clerical Services, Wendy Potter.